Hey, what's up everybody? Uh, as you can see, I'm not Mrs. Sarah. It's me, Pastor Keenan, and uh, Miss Sarah is not here with us tonight. She's getting some time away and she really deserves it because she's been doing such a great job with all of her lessons and uh, just really helping us understand more about who God is. Um, tonight, we're gonna be uh, talking about this thing called Father's Day. And uh, I want you to think of what are you thankful for your dad for? Um, but before we jump into that, I wanna share a joke with you. I really miss my jokes with you and I am excited to share this one with you because it's so awesome. So this joke starts off like this. What do you call your dad when he falls through the ice? I'll give you some time to think about it. All right, are you ready? A popsicle. <laughs> That's right, a popsicle. So, like I said, this week is Father's Day, and uh, tonight what we want to do is we want to spend some time uh, just seeing how awesome our dads are and uh, just making sure that they recognize that we love them and that we are just so thankful for them. So tonight what you'll need is you're going to need a piece of paper, and with this piece of paper, you're going to be making a paper airplane. Um, every time you, uh, so as we make our paper airplanes tonight, what you need to do is you need to think of something your dad has taught you. And every time you think of something that your dad has taught you or a way that your dad has shown that he loves you, uh, I want you to fold your paper airplane. And our verse for tonight comes from Proverbs chapter 22, verse six. It says, Train up a child in the way they should go, and when they are old, they won't depart from it. And that's what our dads do. Our dads teach us stuff. They show us how much they love us, and our dads teach us things. And our dads teach us stuff so that when we get old, and we become adults, and we start to live our lives, uh, our dads teach us stuff that will help us live our lives better. Uh, so what I want you to do tonight is I want you to think, can you think of a time where your dad has taught you something, or your dad has shown you a way that he loves you? And every time you do that, I want you to fold this paper airplane. And every time I, I folded it, uh, I think this is long ways. I don't know for sure. My my lingo, my my verbiage. I don't I don't know. Uh, but I think this is long ways. So um, I'm thinking of all the things that my dad has taught. My dad taught me, and my dad taught me uh, one really big thing that has stuck with me my entire life is that my dad taught me how important ketchup is. <laughs> I'm just joking. No, my dad. One of the most important things that my dad ever taught me was that. Uh, a relationship with Jesus is the most important thing. Uh, and my dad not only taught me that by telling me t telling me about it, but he taught me that uh, by how he lived. And he didn't just say it with his mouth, but he lived it out with the way that he uh, just did everything he, he did, the way he worked, the way he loved my mom, the way he raised uh, my brother, my sister, and I. And so uh, just keep thinking about all the things your dad has taught you. And as you can see, every time you think of that, you fold this paper airplane, and what happens is that the closer you get to being complete, the closer you get to folding it, and it, it starts to look more and more like an airplane, and what happens is that when you're finished, uh, the paper airplane is able to fly on its own. Of course, we're gonna test this out to see if it actually flies. Um, so, because uh, <clears throat> sometimes I folded paper airplanes and I don't do a very good job. My uh, expertise is not making paper airplanes. But uh, in order for a paper airplane to fly, you have to finish it, you have to complete it. And that's what dads do for us. They, they help us grow up, they help us get better so that when we are able to go off on our own and uh, start to have our own families, start to live our lives, get jobs, our dads help us uh, um, just get better at being able to live life on our own. And so, um, send, uh, as you're making your paper airplane tonight, post on uh, Facebook or Instagram or wherever you want, uh, post what your paper airplanes are looking like. 
and help us. Uh, we want to see how you're making your paper airplanes tonight. So mine is starting to look a little bit more like a plane. Um, there's a different. There's a couple different ways for you to make an airplane. I'm going with like the more. Uh, it looks like a stealth jet fighter, but I know that there's ways that you can make a paper airplane that looks like a like a, a big jumbo cargo plane, or or something like that. Um, but be and one thing other one other thing you could do is on your paper airplane after you finish it, you can write down on your paper airplane just all the things you're thankful for about your dad. And after you finish it and make, give it to your dad and show them just how much you care about him and how much you love him. Uh, so here is my paper airplane. It doesn't look, doesn't look that good, but I hope it flies. I'm gonna take it out to the hallway in just a second. But main thing that I want you to learn tonight and, and leave tonight with is that our dads help us learn stuff so that we can go and live on our own and, and live life and be uh, good people. And um, that's what God created dads for. They created dads for, he created dads to uh, uh, help us grow stuff and grow up and learn stuff and be able to live life uh, uh, and, and do life. And so let's see uh, if my paper airplane is actually going to work. So here's how it looks. So I'm gonna flip my camera around. Let's see, can I do that? No, I'm not gonna be able to do that. All right, so here's my, I'm in my office, by the way. This is my office. It's super messy, as you can see, but I'm gonna go out to the hallway right now and see if my paper airplane is gonna fly. So here's the paper airplane, and let's see if it's actually gonna fly. Okay, so it flew. It wasn't as good as I thought, but it flew. So tonight, uh, just write down on your paper airplane all the things that your dad has done for you, all the things that you're thankful for him, uh, for all the ways that you love him, and just know that our dads are awesome. Our dads are amazing, and we're very thankful for them. So uh, we are excited to see you on Sunday, uh, 1045, and... Um, yeah, hope you have a great time celebrating your fathers uh, this week. All right, everybody, we'll talk to you later. Bye.